that you can see sitting in the car has been brought to the synagogue Church of All Nations by her husband. She has a leg fracture due to an accident. As she sits helplessly, unable to walk, she has the hope that Jesus Christ will take her out of her bondage and into freedom. to the Synagogue Church of All Nations. Can you tell us your name? Uh, I'm Iyabo Munteki. Can you tell us what is the problem that has brought you to the Synagogue Church of All Nations today? Uh, it's an uh, accident and I have fracture. It's affected my life because I can't go to toilets if I want to go. It's my husband that used to assist me. I can't do anything on my own. I can't be able to work with it. And since you have been having this problem, can you tell us the effort you have put in place to find solution to this problem? I've went to several doctors, no solution. So I came to Synagogue Church of Onishon and prayed that God should heal me for the salvation of my soul. My name is Bienvenu Munsek. I'm from uh, Congo Democratic. I'm from synagogue today because of uh, the problem for my wife. The problem is for the leg. We are done S3. We are going for many places. No solution uh, now. It's no few work out, no few do anything. I believe, say, the Lord go heal him to prophet T.B. Joshua. Jesus, in the name of 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 Jesus, in the the resurrection power flows through Prophet T.B. Joshua, causing her leg to rise. What was once impossible for her has become possible through Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus, man. In the mighty name of Jesus, man. Thank you. It's free. To God be the glory. Thank you, Jesus. I can walk. Thank you, Jesus. Thank I can walk. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Mrs. Museki came in pain and has now received the joy of resurrection. We can see her walk into the glory of God. I can walk now. Jesus, I can walk now. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. People of God, let's rise up and put our hands together for Jesus Christ. Louder, 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 louder. Yes, who is like our Jesus. Nobody. Yes, and she's in our midst to share with us a wonderful testimony. Ma'am, you're welcome. Can you introduce yourself to us? Tell us your name and where you've come from. Children of God, Emmanuel. Children of God, Emmanuel. If God is with us, who can be against us? Ah, thank you, Jesus. My name is Iyabo Museki. I'm from Nigeria, but I married from Congo. This, uh, I had accidents 18 years ago. The accidents, I was only the, only, the, only, only, only the survivor in that accident. So, 
my leg, um, I have a, a dislocation, fracture in my leg. And uh, I was taken to hospital. Even when I was in the hospital, is after two days, I now realize that I'm, I'm in the hospital. So, um, our father, um, my husband now um, take me to hospital. My, hus my husband take me to hospital, various hospitals, from hospital to hospital. After no way, the doctor said that uh, he will, they will put iron in my leg by that time. So my husband has said no, that uh, he cannot bear it. They now, they now take me out from the hospital and take me to Abba home. From Abba home, no way. They now take me to another Abba home. From that Abba home, no way again. Ah, he now said, ah, what is he going to do? And somebody now introduced my husband to the synagogue church of Onesho. He now brought me here and uh, uh, to the uh, emergency section of the synagogue church of Onesho. Where man of God came and prayed for me. When he was praying for me, it's like um, I was um, asleep, but I, I'm not sleeping. It's like I'm in the trance. So I saw two, two doctors with me by that time. That two doctors, one was holding brush and one was holding screwdriver. They now open my leg. They now open my leg. So when they now open my leg, they now start, the other one that old brush, now started brushing my leg because they open it. They now started brushing my leg. When they are brushing my leg, after brushing the leg, the other one now started screwing the leg. That was the time that man of God said, get up, you are healed, you are free. And since then, I've been walking freely, those things that I cannot do, I cannot walk without crutches. I've been walking since then. There is no problem. Since then, I've been walking freely without no crutches, without no any problem. Let's put our So I want together. to walk for you now. <laughs> this is me. This is me. I don't know what to say. I just... Thank God for what God have used Senior Prophet T.B. Joshua to do in my life oh, for healing me. Oh. Let's put our hands together for the miracle walking God. Yes, ma'am, we thank God for what he has done in your life. Ma'am, tell us what word of advice do you have for the benefit of the viewers listening? Hmm. My advice is for you to believe in God. Believe in God that you are serving. Don't put your ear in what people are saying. Those are distractions. Please. Those are distractions. Believe in God and come to Synagogue Church of All Nations for your healing, for your deliverance. Escuchamos el increíble testimonio de la señora Iabo. Ella nos comenta que tuvo una fractura del peroné hace 18 años luego de tener un accidente. Ella había ido al médico de diferentes doctores y ninguno pudo encontrar la solución para su problema más que una operación. Le dieron un soporte para la zona afectada y diferentes medicamentos, pero ella no tenía ninguna mejora al problema. Hasta que llegó aquí hace 18 años a la arena de la libertad, donde el hombre de Dios oró por ella y ella recibió su sanidad instantáneamente. Ahora ya puede caminar. Y está aquí 18 años luego testificando de que el milagro sigue intacto en su vida. Espectador, mantente conectado. Les soeurs et mondes nous allons entendre le magnifique témoignage de guérison de Madame Iabo. Il remercie Dieu pour sa guérison il y a de cela 18 ans. Elle a eu un accident de circulation et sa jambe a été fracturée. Elle a été amenée d'urgence à l'hôpital et les médecins ont suggéré qu'elle subisse une intervention chirurgicale car elle a été diagnostiquée d'une fracture du ferronné discal. Son mari a refusé qu'elle subisse cette intervention et l'a amenée chercher des traitements traditionnels, mais en vain. Elle a été amenée ici à la Squana et le prophète Tibi Joshua a prié pour elle et elle a reçu sa guérison instantanée. Et elle a pu marcher pour la gloire de Dieu. Et voilà, elle est ici aujourd'hui en train de témoigner que depuis sa guérison, elle est toujours guérie, elle continue à marcher. Elle conseille à tout le monde de continuer à croire à Dieu et de continuer à s'accrocher à Dieu. C'est tout le monde entier, restez connectés. <rires> 